Have you ever wondered how the camera was born? Well, the story of the camera's birth isn't a simple one. It begins centuries ago with a device known as the camera obscura. This ingenious invention, a box or a room with a small hole in one side, was the precursor to the cameras we know and use today. What made the camera obscura so special? When light passed through the small hole, it projected an image of the scene outside onto the opposite wall. This principle, known as pinhole image formation, is fundamental to all cameras from the earliest to the most modern. Now let's travel back in time to ancient China, where a philosopher named Mozi first mentioned the camera obscura around the 5th century BC. Mozi observed how light travels in straight lines and used this understanding to explain how the camera obscura produced upside-down images. Fast forward to ancient Greece. The renowned philosopher Aristotle was fascinated by the camera obscura. He used it to observe solar eclipses safely, without damaging his eyes. Then in the Renaissance, the genius artist and inventor Leonardo da Vinci provided detailed and accurate descriptions of the camera obscura. He saw its potential not just for scientific observation but also for artistic pursuits. He recognized that it could be used to trace the projected images, creating incredibly realistic drawings. These early uses and improvements of the camera obscura by such influential figures were monumental steps in the evolution of the camera. They brought humanity closer to capturing and preserving moments in time, one of our most cherished abilities today. But the camera obscura, as innovative as it was, was just the beginning. It was a stepping stone, a spark of brilliance that ignited a revolution in visual communication. It inspired generations of inventors and artists who would refine, adapt, and reinvent it, leading us to the sophisticated cameras we have today. The camera obscura laid down the foundation for what was to come, the birth of the camera as we know it today. Fast forward to the 19th century, the era of rapid advancements in technology. The world was on the verge of an industrial revolution, and photography was not left out of this whirlwind of progress. Enter Nice for Nieps, a French inventor who was about to change the game. In 1826, after numerous attempts, Niepce was successful in creating what is considered the first permanent photograph. His method, known as heliography, involved using a pewter plate coated with bitumen, a substance that hardens when exposed to light. This was a process that took a whopping eight hours of exposure to the sun. It wasn't perfect, but it was a start. Just over a decade later, in 1839, another Frenchman, Louis Daguerre, introduced a new photographic process to the world. The daguerreotype, as it was known, was a significant leap forward. It involved exposing a silver-plated copper sheet to iodine vapor, which created a light-sensitive layer. The result was a sharper, clearer image that required less exposure time. This was the first practical method of photography, and it quickly spread worldwide. But the evolution of the camera was far from over. Across the English Channel, William Fox Talbot was hard at work developing a different photographic technique. By 1835, he had developed the calotype process. Unlike the daguerreotype, which produced a single image, the calotype created a negative that could be used to make multiple positive prints. This was a revolutionary concept, one that would become a fundamental principle of photography. These inventions were milestones in the evolution of the camera. They laid the groundwork for the sophisticated photographic devices we use today. Each invention was a step forward, a piece of the puzzle that eventually gave us the ability to capture and preserve life's moments in a way that was once thought impossible. These pioneers of photography pushed the boundaries of technology, and in doing so, they forever changed how we see the world. These inventions were milestones in the evolution of the camera, leading us to more sophisticated photographic devices. As we move further into the 19th century, we witness the birth of film, a period of vibrant innovation and creative exploration, where technology and artistry began to intertwine in fascinating ways. The pivot point, the catalyst for this change, was the invention of roll film by none other than George Eastman. Picture this, it's the late 1800s and George Eastman, a man with a mind for invention and an eye for opportunity, is about to revolutionize photography. He introduces roll film to the world, changing the way we capture and preserve our memories forever. This wasn't just a minor tweak or a slight improvement, no, it was a seismic shift that transformed photography from a complex, cumbersome process into something that was accessible and manageable for the everyday person. Eastman's vision was clear. He wanted to make photography as convenient as the pencil. And boy did he deliver. 
His invention of roll film was a true democratizer, stripping away the previous barriers and complexities of photography and allowing anyone with a camera to capture the world around them. But Eastman didn't stop at roll film, he saw further, he saw bigger. He went on to create the first Kodak camera, a simple, easy-to-use device that incorporated his innovative roll film. It was a camera for the people, designed to be used by anyone and everyone. It was this combination of roll film and the Kodak camera that truly brought photography to the masses. The impact of these inventions was profound. They broke down the walls that had previously confined photography to a select few. They made it possible for anyone to be a photographer, to document their lives, their experiences, their worlds. The ripples of these innovations are still being felt today in every snapshot, every selfie, every breathtaking image that captures a moment in time. The invention of roll film was a game changer, setting the stage for the development of the modern camera. It was a pivotal moment in the story of photography, a moment that brought us one step closer to the incredible photographic possibilities we enjoy today. Entering the 20th century, we see the dawn of digital photography. It's a groundbreaking period, one that signaled a shift from analog to digital, with all the potentials and possibilities that this new technology promised. The first digital camera was born in a lab at Eastman Kodak in 1975. A young engineer named Steven Sasson was the mastermind behind this invention. Using a handful of motor components, a portable cassette recorder, and a Super 8 movie camera lens, Sasson created a device that could capture images in a digital format. Though it was as large as a toaster and took 23 seconds to record a black and white image onto a cassette tape, this was a significant leap forward. Fast forward to 1990, the first commercially available digital camera, the DICAM Model 1, hit the shelves. This compact point-and-shoot camera was a far cry from Sasson's bulky prototype. It was capable of storing 32 grayscale images which might seem trivial by today's standards, but back then, it was nothing short of revolutionary. With the advent of digital cameras, photography was no longer a costly hobby or a profession restricted to the few. Now anyone could take as many pictures as they wanted without worrying about running out of film or the cost of developing it. Images could be instantly reviewed, deleted, or saved. This gave photographers, both amateurs and professionals, the freedom to experiment, to learn, and to grow. Moreover, digital cameras opened up a whole new world of possibilities. They allowed for easier sharing and distribution of images, making photography a more collaborative and interactive art form. You could now share your vacation photos with family across the globe, or your artistic shots with a worldwide audience. The advent of digital photography revolutionized the way we capture and share moments. It democratized the art of photography, making it accessible to all. And it's fascinating to think that this journey started with a simple digital camera, a device that forever changed our relationship with images and how we perceive the world around us. And now, we live in an era where cameras are at our fingertips. In this momentous age of technology, the camera has become a part of our daily lives. It is no longer a luxury or a specialized tool, but an everyday companion. With the integration of cameras into smartphones, the power of photography is quite literally in our pockets. What was once a complex and expensive hobby has now become accessible to all. Whether you're capturing a stunning sunrise, a spontaneous burst of laughter or a well-plated meal, the camera on your smartphone is always ready. This accessibility has not only changed the way we capture moments but also how we share them. Within seconds, a snapshot can be taken, edited and shared with the world, connecting us in ways we could only dream of in the past. But let's not forget about the advances in camera technology. The invention of mirrorless cameras and DSLR cameras has revolutionized the field of photography. These devices have been designed to be lighter, more compact and more user-friendly, yet they offer the same if not better image quality as their traditional counterparts. The rise of mirrorless cameras in particular has been a game-changer. By doing away with the mirror mechanism used in DSLRs, these cameras are not only smaller and lighter, but they also provide real-time image preview, high-speed shooting, and silent operation. On the other hand, DSLR cameras with their interchangeable lenses and advanced manual controls have given amateur photographers the tools to take professional quality photos. They've opened up a world of possibilities from macro photography to astrophotography and everything in between. These technological advances have made it easier for anyone to become a photographer. They've empowered us to capture the world as we see it, to tell our stories through images, and to preserve moments that would otherwise be fleeting. From the camera obscura to the camera in our smartphones, 
The journey of the camera is a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of capturing moments.